Hey guys, it's Lee, and today I am back with another Timu haul for you. And just so you know, this haul is sponsored. If you haven't heard of Timu, they are an online marketplace that sells just about everything you might need, and all at affordable prices. They have women's clothing, men's clothing, children's clothing, shoes, they have small appliances, they have cookware, things for your pets, they have a bit of everything. And they currently have a sale going on where you can save up to 90%. And on top of that, I have a coupon code for you, which will be across your screen right now, as well as in the description box, where when you search that code in the Timu app, you will get a $100 coupon bundle. As I show you the items, the prices will be right up here on your screen, and the links will be down in the description box below. Those links are not affiliate links, just so you know. This haul has a lot of kitchen items in it. Um, there are some other items as well. I'm so excited to show you everything. I'm gonna start off with the non-kitchen items. So firstly, I got these. These are rubber shoe covers. So if you're going to be out in the rain or if you're going to be gardening and you don't wanna get your shoes all gross, these slip right over your shoes and they keep them nice and protected so they won't get dirty, they won't get wet. And this is like a non-slip pattern on the a texture. Texture is what I was looking for on the bottom. And I can't wait to try these when I'm out in my garden. So next I picked up these pens. One is cat themed. These are cat the cat lovers pen set and I got the dog lovers pen set. So the cat lovers pen set says I just want to pet all the cats. Cats are cheaper than therapy. Cats are greater than people. Ask me about my cat and sorry I'm late. The cat was napping on me or my cat was napping on me. I think all of those are so cute. I'm going to share these with my daughter and maybe one of my friends. I also picked up the dog lovers. Ask me about my dog. Get a little closer. Sorry, I can't. I have plans with my dogs. Dogs are cheaper than therapy. Dogs are greater than people, and hi, can I pet your dog? I actually wish there was one that said, sorry I'm late, my dog was sleeping on me, because we have the chihuahuas and at least one of them. If I'm sitting in a chair, there's at least one, sometimes two of them on my lap. So these are so cute. I'm gonna open them and see how they write. So I have one of the pens, piece of paper. I don't know if you can even see. Oh yeah, I like them. My handwriting's not the best, but they write really smoothly. So that's good to know. And they have black ink. Next I picked out this electric nail machine, they're calling it. It's an electric nail cutter. It comes with the device, a charging cable, which I don't have with me right now because I was charging this. It's a type C and this little cleaning brush. So take the top off and you have the nail clipper and the nail polisher. And on this side, I have charged this, so you long press this to turn it on. Okay, and once it's on, you press this side for the nail cutter. I'm not gonna put my nails down in there right now. Let's do it this way. You have a light so you can see, but you put your nail down in there and it will cut your nail or trim your nail. There are two speeds. And then on this side is a nail polisher. Can you see that rotating? I'm not even sure. Goes a little bit faster too. I don't know if you can even tell it's rotating, but it is. And I just thought this would be fun to try out. I'm gonna have my husband try it later and see what he thinks of it. And I just thought it would make trimming your nails easier. Also on this side, you just push right here and you can get the nail trimmings out. And I just thought that was really cool. And I've seen this on their site for a while too and I decided to go ahead and grab one of these. So this next item I picked out is, I hope I'm saying this correctly, it's a Shavap Chi Chi maker and they kind of look like sausages. They are from Southeastern Europe, uh, but that's not why I got it. On here it also says that you can make gnocchi and uh, croquettes with it. So. This is what it looks like. You load whatever you're gonna be using in there, and then you just push it through. I was thinking that we could use these to make 
hamburger hot dogs, if that makes sense. So basically I put the hamburger with the seasonings, mix it all up, put it in here, push it out. I don't know if it'll work. Let me know if you've tried anything like that. It's worth a shot, right? Then we can just put them on hot dog rolls just to have something different. There's no real reason for it other than fun. Maybe I can learn to make chivap chichi. That might be fun too. But here it's showing the meat. You press it through and you have these little, what look like sausages. Yeah, thought it might be fun to try out. Have you ever made anything like this? Let me know. Then I picked out this set of six silicone tea infusers, but they are shaped like tea bags. So you just open it up, put your tea in there, and then use it like a regular tea bag. I'm gonna split these between my daughter and my son who doesn't live here. Like I said, you get six of them. Both of them drink loose leaf tea, like every day. And we go through, and I'm sure my son does through too, a lot of the disposable tea bags. And I was thinking that this might be better for them. So they'll save money in the long run on tea bags, on the disposable ones, and yeah, I was gonna give them each three. They come in pink, green, red. I think it said the colors varied. Blue, orange, and yellow are the ones I got. But these will be perfect for the kids. The next thing I picked out is this set of silicone sheet pan dividers. So if you wanna cook everything on one sheet pan and you need it divided, this comes with four silicone trays and then you put them on your sheet pan. Can you see it? Yeah. You put them on your sheet pan and then you cook whatever is you're cooking in each of those little silicone trays. This is pretty awesome. So maybe you're cooking for vegetarians and non-vegetarians. You can cook your meat in one and other things in the other and that way nothing touches. I just thought these were really cool. So I picked up one set of these to add to my kitchen collection. Next, I saw these bird pattern tea towels and I thought they were just too pretty. This is what they look like. It comes in a set of two. We love watching the birds. We have a bird feeder just outside our, on our deck so we can see it from the family room. And it's so fun watching the birds. Are they the same? I don't know, I think these are different. Um, the dogs really like watching the birds too. They like to bark at them. Um, but anyway, I just thought these were really pretty. And I think I'm gonna use them as decorative towels, we'll see. I just thought they were really pretty. They're definitely different. <laughs> I just thought they were really pretty and they would make a nice addition to the kitchen. And yeah, these are gonna be hanging from the dishwasher and the stove. Next, I picked up this five pack of Swedish dish, dish cloths. That's like a tongue twister for me. So I have never really used Swedish dish, dish cloths. I cannot say it, but I did look into it and I thought I would give them a try. So when you first get them, they feel really hard and stiff. And I'm gonna go ahead and wet this one. So now that it's wet, it's nice and pliable and you can wipe, and it says that you get a streak-free shine if you like are cleaning your windows with them. This is what I've read. I've been wanting to try them out. A lot of people use these in place of paper towels. You can just dry it, whoops. <laughs> you can just dry it out. They last longer than sponges too, I read. So I thought I would just try them out. This says super absorbent, eco-friendly, reusable and biodegradable, made from cotton and wood, wood pulp, machine washable. I think they're pretty cool. Next, I got this little strainer, and I almost said drainer. It's a strainer. We have a double sink, so I wanted to put this on, you know, on the divider there while I'm washing fruit or vegetables or maybe rinsing rice. If it doesn't fit through the holes, we'll see. And I like the fact that it sits there and you don't need an extra hand to hold on to it. And the last item for this haul is a repurchase. We have one of these in a different color. We use it all the time, like all the time. <laughs> this is an enamel coated cast aluminum 
Dutch oven. The one we have currently is like a mint green. So I thought this yellow would be so nice and sunny. This is what the lid looks like. It has a 4.75 liter capacity, which is approximately five quarts. It's a nice big size. I've made soups. I've made big vats of pasta sauce in it. One of the things I like is that it's light. It's easy to carry. I do have a cast iron Dutch oven, but it's so hard for me to get it out of the cabinet. This one is so lightweight and easy to carry, and I love the green one, so I just had to get another one. All right, so that's everything I got from Timu this time around. Which of these is your favorite? Also, let me know down in the comments, what is your favorite product you've ever gotten from Timu? I'm always looking for new things. Like I said before, all these items will be linked down in the description box. Also, my coupon code, which is across your screen right now, will be in the description box. And if you search that code in the Timu app, you will get a $100 coupon bundle. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you'd consider hitting that subscribe button and the little bell so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. You can also find me over on Instagram and Facebook at Lee's Home 05. Thanks for watching. Bye.